Welcome back. Uh, I've got a cool project here going. Um, this is not an instrument, but it is music related. So what I'm doing is I'm making an ingrained cutting board. It's ended up looking really cool. I wasn't planning on making a video of this, but um, it's looking great. So I'm going to do it anyways. And uh, let me know what you guys think of this one. Um, yeah, let's get started. <laughs> These are the parts that I've got so far. Um, a lot of milling left to do on these. Um, first thing I did is I created a drawing. I'll show you that drawing here. Um, this is all designed in Fusion 360. And uh, um, yeah, so I need to make sure that all the parts are very precisely um, cut. Um, that way I, my engraving lays out perfectly on it because I'm mixing engraving with embedded pieces. So for the staff, I have these pieces of maple and uh, walnut that I've cut. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but that's my staff pieces. They'll all get put in here like this. And then the rest I have is ingrained. And then I have some end blocks here because I don't want the staff to run all the way through. Um, and uh, so I've got all the veneers set up for the staffs. And uh, now I just need to mill all of these to the, the width for each piece um, because those have to be also perfect so that the engraving actually happens in the right places. Okay, as long as we're here, I figure I'd show you another one of my tricks for uh, milling rough stock. So these are all glued up. They're very rough on the bottom. I don't have a flat surface to work on. Um, the way the grain's oriented, I don't really want to run this through thicknesser. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach this waste piece of wood um, just with the tape and super glue trick to the spoil board and I'm going to um, cut little pieces of uh, hot glue and place them on this board, heat them up with a heat gun just because it's faster than a glue gun and then I'll press them into it and it'll hold this stock um, at, so that it doesn't wobble. So, the hot glue takes up a lot of space and works really great with that. So, I'm going to do that now. So we surfaced off both sides, ran it through the drum sander, got it nice and smooth. That leaves a lot of little scratches. So after that, <clears throat> sorry. So after that, I had to do a lot of hand sanding, well, hand power sanding with the um, rotary sander. And now we've got it here. Next thing to do is it's aligned on the spoil board perfectly. So I can cut the contour, and then we're gonna do the engraving. It's gonna be really cool. So. Thank you. 